This is Ozark's Fox AM. Welcome back to Hour 2 of Ozark's Fox AM. I'm Kelly Smith. And I'm Jeremy Rabe. Don't adjust your screens. We are in the Christmas spirit. It has thrown up all over me and Kelly. It has. It has. Thank you for letting me borrow this jacket. And honestly, the other jacket that I put on that was a little bit too big, mm -hmm. actually the reds didn't match. The reds match better in this one with even my Even though scarf. the prints don't match, is that okay? But you know what? I can't even tell that. You can't tell on TV. TV. I can't tell. Yeah, it looks great. So thank you. No, I love the... Because, because of Elisa Rafa uh -huh. and her challenge... I have so many Christmas clothes that I cannot wear in the time allotted before Christmas. Again, I really technically don't buy. I only bought one new thing. Remember my flamingo yeah, one? Yeah, yeah. I really like that. Because I have too much, and I can't even, There's several things. I don't even know. I actually left a few things at home because yeah. I don't know what I'm going to wear tomorrow on the last day. Oh, you don't? I have no well, idea. I promise you, you will find it. But I, I never used to buy anything like this. Now, now that we have an opportunity to wear it. I really wish you would go day after Christmas and clearance shop for the Christmas clothes and well, stock up. Well, that's the thing. I'm seeing everything, and I'm thinking this is all going to be on sale, and yes. I should really do that. Um, Just plan ahead for next year. You know what? I do like the jackets, though. Maybe I should buy a jacket and like take it in so that it really fits me. Yes, but although that does fit you really well, though, it I'm really surprised. does. But they don't make these for gals, do they? Uh, yes, they do. On the website that I typically order from, they have the guys' version, and then they have a cute little dress in the girls' version. Oh, wow. and I've looked for um, a snowflake one for Lisa Rafa, uh -huh. but they're always sold out of her size. Because they sell out quickly, and she's a petite young extra, lady. Extra, extra small. Extra, extra, extra small. small. And speaking of Lisa, I do want to... Yes. A viewer just sent this in to us. I didn't send the picture up, so you can't see it on TV, but I loved our viewer so much. Uh, Teresa Kuhlman uh, sent us this picture. She goes, hey, Ozarks Fox AM News. Here's a picture of two foxes on roofs in Breckenridge, Colorado, in the snow. Uh, I don't, I'm so sorry, I didn't have time to send this up, yeah. but if you can get just a little sneak peek at this, look at this quickly because I love that we're Ozark's Fox AM and there's two foxes sitting on the snow covered roof that in Breckenridge. Is adorable. Is that I not amazing? I love that so much. We do love our viewers and they contribute so much to our show. That is so cool. I love it so much. Thank you. Know you know what? What? Uh, we might want to just talk to Elisa and see, well, see if we're going to get any snow. The snow on that roof matches the snow on her jacket. It sure does. Elisa, what's up in the weather? I love this jacket so much. This is Jeremy Rabe original over here. It looks so great on you, by the way. It really does. It does. Thank you. I had a little bit of a dress on me, though, but I love it. <laughs> um, we are starting out with clouds and a little bit of fog in Branson. It's 41 degrees with southerly winds. We do have clouds out there this morning. The clouds are uh, mo you know, mostly cloudy. We've got a lot of that cloud cover, uh, but we're not squeezing out any rain just yet. It's mild out there, too. 41 in Springfield, 40 in Rolla, and 40 in Monette. As you head out the door today. We'll still have mild temperatures like yesterday and the day before and the day before that. Still in the middle 50s, but we will have more cloud cover. Mostly cloudy and still warming up. On this future cast, we keep mostly cloudy skies through the afternoon. Then here comes the cold front with this rain late in the evening and overnight. I think after 6 or 7 o'clock is a pretty good start time for us. We'll have these showers through tomorrow, and then tomorrow afternoon, we'll keep clouds thick. We'll keep a couple of drizzles, and temperatures will be much cooler because of the clouds and this north wind. Today, we'll have a steady south wind, not terribly gusty. Then winds shift to the north and west as the cold front comes through tonight, and they really pick up. Winds gust 30 to 35 miles per hour as we had through Thursday. Rain out of all of this is going to be pretty light, about a tenth to a quarter of an inch, so not expecting too much in the bucket. Uh, for your sneak peek at your Christmas forecast, Christmas Eve, 36 degrees, with some showers possible there. We'll keep some clouds on Christmas Day with a temperature of 52. Again, this is still pretty early. This is a very first look sneak peek, so we'll keep an eye out on this forecast. And if you're curious, while it will be mild, it is not record. The record for Christmas is 74 from 1889. Record wettest is over an inch from 1888. And another record from the 1800s. That is crazy. Three of our Christmas records are so old. Three inches in 1892. The coldest Christmas is back in 1983. Again, uh, still mild today. Drizzle and windy tomorrow. The first day of winter, guys, is on Friday. Jeremy Kelly. First day of winter, it's I Friday. Know. And it actually looks like a pretty nice forecast. I, I mean, know, not, not winter, but not winter. It's nice for my puppies, it, it Alisa. I, I, like I need it. it. I need it to blizzard now, though, so I can wear this jacket. <laughs> oh, 
You know what? I may have to lend that to you because you're more than welcome to wear that anytime you have a snowstorm. <laughs> yes. May I suggest some snow boots, though? <gasps> Instead of those lovely heels that you have on. I really like those. But Thank you. I'll get you the high heel Uggs. How yes. about that? Oh. Uh, With snowflakes on She them. said yes to the Uggs. Yes. You oh, say Uggs? I said Uggs. Uh, she said, I, no, you, I, I, I think you meant Crocs. Is what oh, you're I meant, well, okay. Uggs and Crocs. I'm going to create the high heel Uggs. Uggs are better. Than I think they're already created. I uh, know. I thought the Crocs were high heeled. I know. The Uggs, I think they've got a few. Do they have high heeled Uggs? Yes, because they were so UG, they had to do something. <laughs> I'm serious. That is where the name came oh, from. Right. But anyway, thanks, Elisa. Thank you, guys. I love it. All right, coming up, it's our very last trivia of the Just year with David and Jen. It's movie trivia time. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Jack, <laughs> I love movie trivia so much. I, know. I just love it.